want to. There's a lot of boxes. You think they're all empty? Fine, really. <laughs> that wasn't very convincing, was it? These masks are the old type. Hard to breathe in them. How are you doing? <laughs> think that is Is there something good in there? Oh.
Are you a fellow explorer? I'm on my own. What do you say? Don't worry. Thanks a lot. I'm glad to work with you. valuable. Let's use it well. Hey, you. That's... Uh, forget it. We'll talk later. It's strange to see a cave connected to a building. What do we have here? Well hidden. Back on the surface again. Good. That's light from the surface.
has to be sacrificed. Wait, what are you... How was that? Ugly. For now, just take it easy. Make yourself at home. Everyone all met. I'm not sure. One and for. I one and. I was. The ability won't be. It'll take a while to get the results. Take it easy in the room back there while you wait. Revenant, however, you're a bit you were If my theory is correct, well, here goes. The well, anyway. I I just, if you do. Did you go visit more weapons? You should once you've got.
You remember that scene we witnessed? Okay, let's get going. You have to take whatever you can use. This way leads into the old city. I'm on my way. A map of the depths. Let's take it to Davis. Sorry. Moving out. Up ahead, this is really it. Make sure you're good and set before we go. <laughs> the 
This is a better place to fight. There we go, share party audio. Now people can hear you. Ah, wonderful. Now this place is a home for the lost. Pick up the they can be serenaded by my sweet dulcet tones of, okay, of, swear, of swearing and anger. Oh uh, yes, totally dulcet. Yes, that's what I think when I hear your voice. Oh yes, here we go. Here's where we, here's where we get enemies that take fucking 3,000 hits to kill. At least they still stay good. Enemies that don't stay good are gonna be the real pain. Oh yeah, are we gonna allow daggers? I feel like we should allow daggers. Technically, they are not again a breach of rules. They're not offensive gifts or anything. No, they're not gifts, and they don't deal any damage anyway, for the most part. I mean, technically, we can so allow the use? revenant dagger because while while it is an offensive gift, it is not a useful one. Oh, I'm talking about just the item dagger. Ah. Uh, I don't really have any rules against items for the most part, since most of them don't do anything special. Yakimo, why you gotta be depressed? Fancy clone. Like, this man just made a Call of Duty reference. I've actually noticed two characters now that I've made a Call of Duty reference. Mm -hmm. I'm, I missed an item over here. Great, Dropped something, I didn't spot it. Lost shard. So, nice. many, so many people used to live here. Now, now no one does, is, is basically what EO has said. Oh, uh, well, yeah, that's... I now it's Yakima. depressing, I don't really care. Parking garage. There's a mess of lost it's over there. It's cell. Cell fodder, at least. I must be letting my gem. image slip. Wake up. Gotta love shield enemies that are against walls. Am I right? <laughs> yeah. I mean, those are just the best. They're definitely mm -hmm. lurking around here. Get ready for the combo. Another one that's going right there. Luckily, these enemies don't deal any damage to us yet, or it'd be actually a pain in the arse. Can't see far. Now we get to do a so boss fight. Oh my god, Yakimo does so much more damage than us. I mean, I was gonna backstab it and probably do just as much. Yeah. <laughs> and when I did, I was gonna say, no one said there was any rules against this! <laughs> yeah. I'm not gonna disallow backstabs, because if we accidentally backstab, it's gonna happen eventually, regardless, so... And plus, still... backstabs against certain bosses and against enemies are gonna be basically our only source of damage. Yeah. So do you want to go for the for the underground area or or the mm. moth first? Mm. I mean the underground area will be more of a pain if I'm gonna be real honest with you. I mean yeah, but there's also the fact that we're just gonna strip. We're 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 gonna kill the, that boss first because. For the time being, she's going to be the bigger pain in the ass, and the underground area is just going to be the extra whipping. So we want to go for the underground first, then? Eh, sure. Okay. I'm just going to fall. Fall Coming damage is not ladder. scary enough to me. <laughs> I love how Yakubo comments on it, commented on it as we fell. What did he say? Look at this ladder. Don't want to let it go to waste. Damage. I have to backstab that enemy shit. I have to backstab that enemy twice for my backstab to go through. 
Uh, yeah, or sometimes that happens with the internet connections. I can backstab an enemy like seven times before it actually activates. But yeah, my my blood veil does about six thousand when I backstab. You know, I don't really have a whole lot of backstab damage from blood veils. Very good eye. None of my blood veils that I like, like actually use are built around that because I just don't do a lot of backstabbing. Ow. Dude. And it's this enemy that's gonna be the biggest pain in the ass, the fucking big boxers. Yeah, and he got dealt with like the mob. He broke his knees. Oh, I can heal myself 12 times, holy shit. I can heal myself 5. Yeah. I have the no, usual I have, 10. I have augmented regeneration. Ah. Um. Let's not go that way. I don't yeah. want to deal with an endless onslaught of enemies. I'm going to be real honest with you. I mean, that's an early rape area. Yeah. Luckily, those things aren't very common. No I mean, I found the rape the rape rooms are not is are not as hard to deal with. Like, later on, once you got more experience to deal with them. Let's not kill anything else in this area, so we don't have to deal with those fucking other annoyances. Oh boy, uh, yes, Fog, my favorite. Sorry, my, my, say, I had to say Shovel Blood Bus. Well, this guy auto aggro on me, you know? What a douche. My favorite fog that's not going away. Do we have to kill the boss first? No, we don't. I've been through here and killed her, killed the fucking thing first before the boss. No, I my mean like it off. No, that shouldn't be the case. Oh, I, I can see little bits and pieces. I think it's gonna. No, it's just my imagination. Why? <laughs> Here, give me a second. I'm gonna seize cooperation, see if it goes away. Mm -hmm. It immediately went away. Yep. Gotta kill it for the other boss first. You know, I really can't summon you in this area. Um, let me see if going down into the actual like depths of the area will change anything. Let's head on down. Since you know parkour, pain in the ass. I mean, one time I literally just dropped down, I missed a jump, dropped down to like, the level I needed to be. Mm -hmm. I got, lost all my health and EO immediately healed me. So I was <laughs> like, oh, speed run tracks. <laughs> you know, I don't know how to do this entire thing without dying or taking any fall damage. But it's not easy either. <laughs> it takes a lot of memory on how to do it. And and oh, just timing, timing—that's the key factor here. I've already made one too many close calls. Oh boy, there we go. I've made it. That's a hell of a I don't know how a pipe has drain function. Now I gotta go through another loading zone. Like they tell you that the that the pipe is basically just like. Oh, it's just a regular pipe, but it's got drain function. Hold on. Maybe. Okay, how? The drain function comes from your veil. Mm. Okay, I think once I get past this wall of fog, it should be fine. I'm sending out a signal. <laughs> I'm actually curious as to where you teleport in from. Mm. 
could be that you spawn in uh, in this city. That's an entire possibility. So you're loading in right now, yeah? Mm hmm. Loading. Loading. No, oh, oh thank god. Okay, good. Now I can activate this cutscene. Second. Can you hear me? Yeah. Okay. I'm back. Mm. Um, I just thought I saw something while you were gone. Hmm? I think we can operate. I like how your character looks at least human. My character looks like if you saw this in a dark alley, you would run the other direction. Yes. Oh no, I think I'd run from somebody wearing um the this blood veil in general. But just like armor blood veil, a mask, has completely heterochromic and unnatural eyes. I mean I run from someone wielding a giant fucking pipe well anyway. In the dark. At least you got this place one up oh god you don't. This is the only place where I could not find the entire map. I think I'm, I think I did, but I don't remember exactly where I found the final part. It's supposed to be in here go. somewhere. I don't know how much it's supposed to be in the go. area, oh, but nice. I've gone nice. through everything in here and I could not find it. I want to jinx it, but this early part really isn't that bad. I did no damage with that. I did absolutely no damage with that. I mean, you might have done more due to the fact that I buffed you as you went to do it. I still did absolutely nothing. I actually had the fire when I hit. Let's spawn. Yeah, I did. Okay. See, I'm looking all around here. I just don't see the fucking. I mean, I think you're looking a bit too frantically. Well, I can't exactly move fast in this area now, can I? Yeah, I got well. Got problem with that. Oh. Gotta Such a minor inconvenience. Yeah, that minor inconvenience actually will kill you. you. Gotta love it. Yep, give me a minute. This is why I always have poison curing items, because fuck this shit. I just don't always have to flip, that's the only thing. I mean, I would Oh have my them god, all... there it fucking is. I finally found it after fucking searching for it for like three days in total. <laughs> Yay, now we won't suffer time. through- Now we won't be bumbling around in the dark. That means all of my maps are now completed. 
I mean, I, this area is literally pointless. Like, you don't need to come over here. It's just for completion. And also the fact that... There's this vestige, but, like, I already have it, you know? Yeah. But, uh, Thanks. maybe fighting this guy was not a smart move? Um, on your so. own, probably not. <laughs> no. I'm coming, but I'm being body blocked by Big Dick big, big over here. Alright, bud. Ow. This is a boss fight, pretty much. I mean, I was gonna backstab him and say, alright, bud, Timber. Ugh, thank God for the run button. I, when I first per started playing this game, I didn't realize there was a run button until after I was through this area. I mean, that's why the early thing, earliest things I look for in a game, where's the sprint button? I, I was not aware there was even, like, sprinting capabilities is the problem. I pressed the button, like, many, many times and did not feel sprinting at all, I just assumed. Man, eventually I'm going to get annoyed that my backstabs aren't going through. Oh yeah, that's the, that's the problem with not being the host, is you can't backstab with a dam. You know what's gonna be really annoying? What? The thunder enemy in here. You just brought back painful memories. I did not want to research. It's also a boss in one of the DLC oh, areas. No it's That's that top. But it's considered it's a boss. Back that we the wall. Why do? Why? Why controller? Why do you do that? This isn't as painful as I thought it'd be early on. Yeah, it's gonna oh. be a late game that's gonna be ass <laughs> though. Yeah, because the game is like, why in hell are you using a pipe? <laughs> it's not the game, it's the it's the stats that are gonna make you go, why in the hell are you still using this? Oh, I see him in the distance. Like I even care about uh, that. missile? Did you, did you get this? Me, Am I retarded or is it on my screen that you didn't get it? We're safe for now, at least. But uh, yeah, I see the thunder enemy in the distance. I see him pixeling in and out. Can't wait to go in that direction. This lever looks important. Luckily, you keep keys. Look, the water's mm -hmm. No, you don't, though. When you NG plus, you lose your keys. I swear. I swear. The water level is always lowered when I come here. <sighs> it is going to be the most magical moment when I actually get a backstab on an enemy that is worth backstabbing. Travel safely. Imagine going through this entire area without lowering the water level. I'd kill myself before that point. <laughs> uh, yeah, my... You didn't. You didn't do it, did you? I only learned it later in a walkthrough and why to kill myself. Oh, that's okay. I remember I didn't run through here, so it's even worse for me. Oh, thank you for just bunching together like that. There's the there's the fucking motherfucker. Get ready. Uh, up, up, and up. Give me a sec to use an Iker concentrator or two. 
so that I can fucking use this. Okay. My body is Reggie. Fuck this gun. Just die. Die. Get poisoned already. Die. Get your kneecaps broken. <laughs> oh, thank God. That's an Eagle key. We want. We wanted to destroy that thing so badly that its HP just plummeted. Nope. Sit down. <laughs> Unfortunately, it was not an enemy that was worth a damn. Because his HP is already on death's door. I basically just overkilled it. By the way, would you say co-op is a good way to get haze? Is a good way to get haze? Yeah, totally. I usually do that for farming haze if I'm like really fucking bored. And plus, you get marks of honor, which you get an. I think you get an achievement for getting enough marks of honor. So. Also, Coco has a uh, thing that that uh, does something for your haze. Oh yeah, I know. I, I was using it earlier today. Hmm. I should probably max proficiency on that one. I swear there's, there's a lot of... Oh, no, there's no there there Okay, I guess we get to go through fucking... Don't run too I'm far gonna ahead. check the map real quick. Um... I think that we're gonna need... Lost. I think Distance. we're getting a key here. Yeah, that or a vestige. Sure. Yeah, yeah, a key. There's enemy. a vestige, but I'm pretty sure this enemy... We need to kill it regardless, I feel like. Alright. Timber, bitch. Nice. Yep, moss covered key. I think I think at least for stronger enemies, my backstabs are going to be this That's close to clutch thing. thing in front of them. <laughs> because my backstabs, as we have both of them. You know what's gonna be true time. pain? This next segment. What? Yeah. As we both observed, my backstabs hit like a monster. <laughs> Cause you know what's up here, right? Yep, that. That's why I walk through this area while blocking. Yep, me too. I see when I block. Come on, target me, bitch. I see when I block. I've dodged one of these things damage. that will cause them to roll right off the cliff. Yeah, that's also nice. That's usually what I do to them uh, when yeah. going through the snow area. Is to let them roll themselves right off the cliff. By the way, this trap has almost killed anyone. Yeah, all the poison enemies right here? Yeah. Yeah, I hate it too. I managed to avoid it, but almost. Overall material, okay. yay! That's one fight down. Let's open it up and see, shall we? Prayer shawl. You know, I'm almost tempted to equip a bad veil, like a veil that's not plus 10 just for the... just for the higher <sighs> drain attack. <laughs> yeah, but all I'm getting from mine is gift damage, and that's useless. Yeah, but do you have any other blood bales for plus 10 that would help you? No. <coughs> but I do have GHX Assault, which is decent for this area. Mm -hmm. But it's not outdoing my current one. My current one is my, like, normal best one. <laughs> Nothing gets really better than it right now. I mean, I think that one's just best for you right now. I'll need to undo down. the fire bonus on it, though. That's the only thing. I mean... Then it'll be does decent. That, does that... does that veil, uh... That scale, scale with gifts that are, give, that are given to you by me fire buffing? I have no. It just it's giving me more fire resistance, and I only have that because I was doing the fire DLC. Mm. This was the veil I used for it because it was really good. Whew. This area. This In area, I don't really find it that bad, honestly. It's just annoying more than anything. I I think this area probably mostly relies on the fact that you didn't see that lever there. Yeah, but they're pretty obvious, 
honestly. Yeah, you can, yeah, you can hit them right here. off. <laughs> Yakumo almost fell in the pit. Yeah, the thing is, I hate it when the AI teeter on the edge. I'm just like no. they almost never fall no. though. Despite that, I, I have yet to have my AI fall off. I've had it happen, and it is terrible. Because you're just gonna be like, all right, I gotta go fight this enemy. Yet yeah, uh, Yakumo has been defeated by what gravity? I, I almost want it to come up with Yakumo has been defeated by gravity. Now the fun part is right here. You mean because you're most around dodging and dodging and the pipe doesn't block the shit? Because if we're not lucky, oh, and we're not that. paying attention, then we have to fucking fight that and this at the same time. Also, parries are going to be very nice. Yeah, I should probably, I should probably remember I can do that. Yeah, I should too, because I'm using the claw, which is like the best for parrying. It's like the small shield of Govain. Yeah. And you can parry almost any enemy I notice. Yeah. Alright, so if I look at the map here, if we we have to go there first for the missile. Can't say I'd like to stick around. Oh, Let's say we skip that treasure chest. Yeah. If nothing else, I'm a navigator. Never mind, we're getting this treasure chest. <laughs> oh my god. They're not gonna leave us alone, so we're killing them. Ow. Wow. This is such an obvious beginner's trap of- Oh, treasure chest! I'm just gonna ignore everything around me! I mean, you can see them way before you spot the treasure chest. Yeah, but sometimes, if you're new, you get tough. Never had that problem. There is something. Moving out. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Then again, I before, knew what I was coming into with this before, game. Before, before we go to this boss fight, Why? we should probably reset. Don't worry. I'm fine. I've got all my heals still. I. I. Come on, let's move it. How many heals do you have? Zero. I've sent out a distress signal. <laughs> I like how there's just no words. It just mentally you're like, are you kidding me? <laughs> <laughs> I I didn't I didn't want to bring it up at the worst time. I I e when I'm on low health and you're telling me to heal. <laughs> I don't have any. Why? I didn't want to mention it. I thought you'd be mad. <laughs> <laughs> no, I just didn't say a word because I knew this was the f most effective way to restore your healing. Yeah. That it was either that or jump off an edge. No healing commits the not alive. <laughs> Which is probably something I should be saying, rather than the actual word for it, which is not good for streams at all, no, no. <clears throat> I've been mentally dancing around the word stuff I could say, because I'm just like, there are limits here, and I have to remember that. Oh yeah, do you have the lightning damage gift? Uh, yeah. You should equip it. I can put that on here. Yeah. Although I have it, so it doesn't matter. Let's just go. The fire. Yeah. It's a uh, yes, yeah, fire course, in the middle of you. water. Yes, this makes sense. But uh, by the way, even though this is a run, this cutscene is special. <laughs> Oh, 
Ah, uh, no time for looking at ass today. This is the real thing. I'm just gonna use all my buffs as fast as possible. Or he'd probably die and get slowed again. Fuck, I forgot about the slowness. Oh no, this is the first one. Let's do our best to not get slowed. <laughs> just, you know. I've almost got our poison. You're so close, go, okay. poison. Yep, that venom. The poison down uh. is so nice. Oh fuck, I'm slowed. Oh no, the one thing this boss is good at! Come on, let me oh shit! I'd love to get hit by that today, sweetie, but I'm not going to. Oh, here we go. Actually, I was expecting much worse damage than I got. Yeah. But then I also remember a network error has occurred. What? Uh, no network has occurred. Your time as a guest has come to an end. Yeah. Yeah, but usually it'd say that, but mm -hmm. instead it said network. Did you error. at least get a mark of honor? Yeah. Okay, good. I was about to say, excuse me? <laughs> what I find funny about that boss is that I got hit by it, and I just looked at my HP, I was just like, ah, oh, this, this is a Mia, I'll be back. Do we still have at least one beer? <laughs> Here's the better question. Yeah? Uh, did you uh, point this out on Discord? Uh, I have it automatically pinned. Yeah. Almost all my views come from YT though, so. Yeah. I'm going to BRB again. I. back. Nice. I'm just dodging around around a missile. Mm -hmm. Mostly practice, mostly practicing my dodges. So now we get to head back to the parking garage. We're actually making more progress than I expected. More progress or more progress more quickly? More progress more quickly. Mm. <clears throat> I expected us to be like still doing the swamp. <laughs> I mean, we both kind of know the areas. So it's to be expected yeah, but to make the, the problem quickly. is, is that we we should be dealing no damage. I think we're almost too strong with Yakumo. <laughs> eh, personally, I think we're okay given the fact that Yakumo is a big source of our damage. But there's also the fact that it's not our pipes that are doing the damage; it's our level of life. Well, it's our level being contributed to Yakumo using a normal weapon. 
Yeah. I almost feel like we shouldn't be allowing him because he doesn't use a pipe. At well, least not what, yet. What, what ally does use a pipe is the question. None. Plus, let's just think about it like this. Yakumo doesn't know our run. He's not under our rules. And let's keep it that way. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, it doesn't matter to me in the end. This yeah. is for fun. I'm sending out True. a distress signal, by the way. Gotcha. Plus, we we have we have to give us ourselves at least some things. I wonder if I put my back to the to this, if we'll spawn in the air. Hmm. You trying to get you you out here trying to get a panty shot? No, I'm just trying to see if he'll spawn and fall immediately. Because I'm wearing black lace. <laughs> <laughs> like, you could just ask. Making sure your gear what is else good. would I wear? It may not stun a loss if they end up cutting my clothing, but it might stun a revenue. Oh, I, I just spawned normally. No, you spawned normally. You spawned very close to the edge, though. That's a surprise. Yeah. I would be so angry if you managed to position yourself just perfectly where I fell right to that abyss. <laughs> if not, if that were the case, I would laugh my ass off. I would have been like, how dare you? <laughs> While also left my ass off. You know what I feel like while doing this run? What? Mel Mel Meliodas with a broke with a like broken sword. Broken sword was still effective. Yeah. But the point point being we're still somewhat effective even with a weapon that shouldn't be effective, knowing full well that we could be doing quadruple this damage if we were using a normal one. Yeah. It's time for the raid. Would you believe I wasn't using buffs? Like, while we were fighting earlier. You weren't using what? I wasn't using buffs while we were fighting earlier. This is not I don't use buffs for normal enemies ever. It's not necessary. At least not yet. Unless they're tough ones. Yeah. I only use them for like the really tough ones. And that's it. Some old world materials. We're just killing them as they spawn at their spawn locations. We know this too well already. Ooh, I just nope. backstabbing. <laughs> No backstab for you. If I can't, if I can barely get them, you can barely get them. <laughs> the sad thing is, I actually I did pull, did the backstab animation, but I did get the Iker bonus. Yeah, because I hit him in the face before you could kill him. Rude. Hey. Don't do that. <laughs> you know, I respectfully waited that one time you got the backstab on the weak enemy. Hey. I'll let you kill it. That, that backstab was completely accidental. <laughs> it doesn't mean anything. I'm gonna get stunned if I get hit again. I wish I could hit these guys before they get up. God damn. I know where yeah, they all are. I hate these things more than any other enemy in the entire game for the sheer reason that they're like the cursed enemies in Dark Souls. They're unassuming, but they inflict inhibit. And that has killed me before. Yeah, I'm not a fan of... those fucking tiny things either. Mostly because they just have a ton of ranged attacks and it's annoying to deal with them. Uh, let's get the... What are they even trying to dig out? Crap over here real quick. What do you mean that's not a backstab? That's clearly a backstab. Uh, so, how do you propose we tackle this bullshit over here? That is the question, isn't it? 
Yes. All right. Uh, so because my main problem I'm, with that is I always get knocked off if the fight goes on. What I'm about for too to long. tell you might sound crazy, but head on, rush behind them. Tried it. Just died. Mmm. I've tried it before. That worked. You must have gotten very lucky then. All right, they're all on the left. Nope, there is this one. Wow. Uh, you have a very effective ambush there. Very effective troop, I must say. I've done this. I've played this game already too much. I don't know to shoot this in and out. Okay, there's one on the Below the parking structure. Right hiding. But we can ignore it. Score us one item there. Ow! Oh, did it target at us anyway? Ow. Yep. Nice 30 damage. I'm gonna start focusing on parrying a bit. Yeah, that's what I've been trying to do because I have to get back in the groove a bit. We can climb up here. This is probably the best place to have for us to practice it. Open it up and see, shall we? The enemies Save here have like no difficult timings whatsoever. Open the store. Oh, um, the <clears throat> timings are really not the problem for me. You saw me using the fucking like spear one in the uh, missile up above. Mm -hmm. And the spike one. I the spear absolutely... one. The scorpion tail actually is quite is quite simple when you think about it. Well, it's it got like a, a two second window. delay, right? So you've got to fucking time it perfectly, and you've got to know the timing in and out. You can't just spam it like the claw. Mm, now I'm just sitting here, like, trying to plan shit out. First off, let me do some healing. Um, well, if Yakumo does decent, he can probably take the aggro from the big one while we deal with the small ones. Probably, but uh, just for this. Ah, I appreciate it. No, we're doing my damage type. I. It's dead. Careful. You were the one who almost knocked me off. Oh my god, Yakumo, what are you doing? Get away from me. <laughs> Yakumo, why? I, I think, he like literally I think almost that's walked that's off. That's like it was. Oh. I think I think Yakumo was like, I don't want to deal with these two anymore. <laughs> Yakumo, no, get away from me. <laughs> Yakumo might have it out for you. I'm scared. <laughs> what did you do? <laughs> He's been my partner throughout every single fight. And I usually just let him die and shit. Oh my god, that hurt a bit. Holy shit, did you see how many times I just fucking backstab spammed her? No, I only saw you doing it once. <laughs> Wait a minute, what? You just backstabbed her twice. I just backstabbed her like 18 times. To me, you literally did the entire backstab animation twice. Oh, like, no. my character was not satisfied with one backstab at all. See, his problem was he was focused on my tits. <laughs> like, he, I, I just stood in front of him and all he had to do was walk behind him and hit him twice. I feel like we're in a mob now. Because that's what mobs do. Oh. She does no damage, like, whatsoever. Why are we scared of these things again? Because they used to be scary. Yeah, they're big and bad, but when they hit you, you you just look them dead in the eyes and you're just like, I've moved with a far pack. Yeah, we're way stronger than that right now, and it shows so much. Oh, uh, yes, like, anti-venom. We're gonna need that so badly. Like, we're five times the strength of these like huge ones. The and the only reason this next boss is so hard is because it's poison damage. Also, last time I missed this missile. Oh, uh, yeah, I completely ignored it. I almost we forgot don't. about it. Yeah, last time I missed it, and the reason being is that I went up to the boss and I killed it first try. <coughs> I did like no damage. 
I do more damage by whacking them. Down. The parry finally, and Yakumo screwed me out of it. <laughs> That's okay. Watch this. It might be better to avoid fighting for now. Hmm. Oh, <laughs> fuck up the timing. Immensely. Did it just? I just saw it like for a brief flash take four thousand hey, damage. Yes, it did take that much damage from Yakumo. <sighs> How much Yakimo. healing you got left? Four. Uh, okay, I've only used that's one acceptable. So I've used two. I've got ten left. Alright, so before we go in there, would fire or lightning be more effective? Fire. <laughs> My boss! <laughs> I was gonna start buffing before we walked in. Leroy Jenkins. <laughs> Leroy Jenkins is not the effective <laughs> strategy here. Hey, let go of your ass. It is. I know you. I know you want a sucker, but she's ah, not consenting. Thanks, I know. I know, man. It's hard to get them to consent. Oh boy. I'm kind of just used to this boss at this point. The only thing that's bad is that we do nothing to it. Thank God, Yakumo is just destroying his HP. Dream attacks should deal some decent damage, by the way. You know, I didn't think of that. Oh yeah, they do. Ah! I refuse to die to this boss. You give us some sort of damage. Drain attack definitely give me some damage. Yeah, for me too. Killed it. Good. Yakumo, Yakumo hit it with an attack and I hit it with a Dre attack at the same time. Mm. Yeah, I'll, I'll deal with the cutscenes around here. Get the missile for the next area. Mm -hmm. After taking the elevator and then I'll, I'll quickly change an effect on my blood veil and then yeah. Mm. I bet she ran deep we'll continue inside. forward. Let's go in By the way, this entire time I've been using Prometheus, mm. and I'm one, and I'm wondering about something. Is Jack's blood code supposed to be like an improved version of Prometheus? Because uh, it doesn't on the stats. Not it does really. Not look no, like it, is. it is not at all the same. In fact, it's honestly slower. You will not get quick movement speed. Uh, mm. With a lot of weapons, like you would with Prometheus, they're similar but not quite the same. I mean, I get quick with the pipe, but the problem is E plus, A plus, C plus, C plus, C plus, A plus. What the hell are these stats? Nothing. No, Heimdall is. is I think it's it's just specialized in highly aggressive melee combat, but its weight allowance is extremely low, and so the only thing that's good on it is its dexterity and fortitude. It's like kind of tanky, but not really. And I like my more balanced stats too. You received a reward. I don't um, know. I have. Huh? This does more I damage got, to my base. I got valuable partner. Uh, nice. Literally, one of the uh, the final things to get for 400 metal marks is Hero of the Ages. Yeah, and it's hell to get. How many boss fights? <laughs> A lot. Oh, what do I want to get? Mm. Is there any place you can see your overall uh, stat increases from your mind and vitality and all that? She's yeah. Because mm. uh, currently, 
With what I've got, I've got A, A plus, B, C plus, B, A plus. Uh, well, what you can do is you can go to your stats, uh, your, 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 um, blood code selection page, right? And turn passive effects on and off, and you can see the change from, like, any bonuses, but you can't really see the exact differences, it's the only thing. Mm-hmm. Oh! Oh, there's some bonuses! Grateful to the government over that, at least. Normally, Prometheus would be B plus B plus C plus C plus C plus A plus. Or, sorry, A. Yeah, you could turn off bonuses and see just how bad you would be without any of your passives. Yeah. Don't run too far ahead. I mean, with Hades, I got an S's strength. Yeah. You know, the way I see it is my stats are basically useless. The only thing that's going to matter is how how good I can get. Mm. Defense that's... and health are the only things that are going to matter, along with speed. Also, the reason that Heimdall doesn't look good or good to me is because I actually don't have what what I have on Prometheus on it. It's technically got a little bit more damage, but not still not very good. Mm. Time to go through the cruise cutscene. We'll just skip it, like every other single one. I've actually never done the successor of the ribcage fight without all of the ISIS vestiges. I mean... So I wonder what, what, um... Nobody which McCall it'll get. Want to relive that. Except, um, uh... Queen's ribcage, I guess? Uh, yeah, probably something like that. I don't know. I mean, the reason that I'd never even think to not want to do that is because I, uh, I, have, I like the successor of the ribcage. Like, once you see your story, she's really, really nice. Yeah, you know, the thing is we're not doing that this run. Yeah, I'm, I'm probably going to feel sad about that, but it's not in my game, so I don't have to feel as sad. I mean, there's always NG+, anyways. Yeah. I am going to have to eventually from get the bad ending for myself. I'm still salty. I, I fucked up the successor with the claw. Like, I was so close to the true ending. Well, the... The... What is it? Like, the Queen's Claw, whatever the fuck it is, it does give you mm -hmm. some decent spells to work with, so it's not too bad, in all honesty. I mean, the, the, yeah, the blood coat isn't that bad, but it's the fact that, like, once I, once I came under the realization that I couldn't restore the memory, I just looked at Yakubo and felt really, really bad. Because I was like, I restored everybody else's, like, friends and I killed yours, I'm so sorry. <laughs> Which blood veil do you want to transform? I hope I didn't take that first one. <laughs> oh, wait. And I just realized why Yakumo has been trying to kill you. <laughs> he might be mad at me. <laughs> so mad, in fact, that he might accidentally bump you off an edge. By the way, just tell me when you get that distress, distress signal going. Mm-hmm. Because I literally have almost this entire area around this missile covered in footsteps. Pipe of Thraldom Venom. Hermes okay. Chrome. Who do I get that from again? Hermes? Davis? Looks like hold on the person he served a habit this is I'll leave. That reminds me, I should probably put something on my pipe, shouldn't I? Yeah, I'm gonna put Venom on it because it 
Then I don't have to really spam Venom shit all the time. Ooh. Yeah, that should give me some time to put something on my pipe. Hi. Which weapon do you want to transform? I think that uh, around uh, Cathedral of the Sacred Blood is where I start getting Queen Steel. Yeah. Um. So I lose three damage from putting Venom on it. <laughs> you, dude. <laughs> Three damage. Oh my I mean, God, the pipe so is really light, so I'm hoping that if I put what I'm going to put on it, it will not go to normal. You mean fortification? Yeah. Yeah, no, it won't change. You're using the same blood veil as me, so. Which blood veil do you want to transform? <laughs> I don't even remember where I got Vanaris Claw. Why is increasing the base so much better than increasing the scaling? I will never understand. I think it just looks better on paper. No, it's 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 better because the you get both base and scaling by increasing by using hey. fortification, but you get a shitload of scaling from intensification. Hey, Yakimo, let me jack you off for some of that hot, uh, Atlas Chrome. <laughs> And you get slightly better like stat increases on like the yeah stats on crit go slightly better, but it's still not as good as fortification. I find it funny how I just straight up bases. walked up to Yakimo and just like, hey, let me jack you off because of that. Because <laughs> okay. that's basically what you're doing for some of these people. It's like, hey, I so want this from you, else. but I'm just gonna give you things until you give me what I want. This I should be a bit better off. Kill her face does chrome stun. Okay, take and I'll be fine. Okay. My pipe of them gained ten damage. <laughs> yeah, so I put venom on because I realized none of those were gonna be enough. <clears throat> if you really I mean... wanted to increase your damage a lot, I would I would put fire or like thunder or ice or venom. <laughs> Mate, I'd have to check what I'd have to check the numbers on those. Um fifty. Fifty? Fifty elemental damage. From the fire, ice and thunder and blood or whatever you want to put on it. Uh but venom, you know, it does health percentage damage. I think it's like a very it's a very small amount, but it's still a good bit. On higher health enemies it'll make a difference. Mm. You mean because Venom is technically, uh, percentage based? Yeah. Mm. Okay, I'm sending out a distress signal right now. We have to keep going. Mm. That's all. Come on. Let's pin down the source. What if I put. Okay. Would inhibit Let's help us at all? Done. Not really. So, you got Venom on yours. Yeah. I think I'm If gonna... you also put Venom, you'll be able to make us proc now, the so you don't status effect later. faster. Yeah. Hold on, I gotta jack off Dave Davis for that chrome. <laughs> I guess with that, I won't really need Venom Mark. I'll, I'll keep it just in case, but I'm gonna put something else in a different spot. Let's see, blood weapon isn't going to be very useful for this fight. Ice won't be very nice either. I guess we'll go for lightning weapon. Hermes, chrome. When and dealt just for weapon. giggles, I'm going to use the rest of what he can give me for uh, boss charts. Oh. I always use the stuff to get more uh, regen inducers, uh, Iker concentrates, the the blood items, stuff like that. Alright, I've got Venom on my weapon. Nice. I'm just gonna go to some random areas and uh, accept a distress signal. Yeah.
Man, I hope this person gonna be helping us use the pipe. That would be really inconvenient. <laughs> I heard that. Hmm. You'd never use a pipe. Yeah, I totally don't. I totally don't have a pipe equipped or anything. No, 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 never. And it, it's it's definitely not like an elemental enhanced pipe. <laughs> Yeah, it's totally not a venom pipe. Oh my god, people are gonna look at my inventory and go like, what the fuck? <laughs> what? We've moved to an area where multiplayer is in unavailable, what the fuck? I've moved three inches backwards behind the fucking missile and it cancelled my distress signal. <laughs> wow. Amazing. I, I just, oh, I, just I just I just come into this I just come into the world and like I spawn where multiplayer isn't allowed and the fucking fog wall just cuts me in half. <laughs> I the fog wall appears now that you joined wow. Queen Steel. Queen Steel is a is essentially blood given metallic form. So I don't I don't know what you'd have to gain from grinding it down. Uh, oh yes, this was. Oh hold on, hold on, <laughs> hold on, hold on. Do it again. Hold on. <laughs> that again. <laughs> I had an idea with that. for a spectacle. Yes, you would have put the on the back unaware. Uh, the poison is actually really good. It is. Not an ideal battle. Yeah, it's, it's applying it every time we hit, so I don't even need venom anymore. That's that's really good. That means I can put something else on if I want, like. I mean, I honestly IFF. think my eyes look better when they're turned blood red while doing that emote. Mm. Oh no! Unexpected enemy that was totally expected. To take whatever you can use. <laughs> Thanks, Yakimo. That was necessary. Uh, is there an enemy behind us? Question mark? Oh, it's above us. I think, or no, it's below. Bo I don't know. There's an enemy somewhere nearby. It's below, apparently. I believe. Oh yeah. Cause yeah, look at that. yeah that I see it. I think I see something over there. Do you, Yakubo? Do you? What did he say? He didn't say anything on my end. I think I see something over there. Oh. It might be that very obvious spear lost. <laughs> oh, I don't know. I was thinking maybe it was the vestige we walked past. Backstab. I, my character was committed to that backstab. Yeah, you can't be verbal backstabbing. Holy crap, the poison damage is good. Oh, we weren't even dealing poison damage in poison damage. Yeah, actually. I know, but like the proc happens so quick. Yeah. Well, let's mosey. I, that's prob, that is probably going to be our best ever source. Mm -hmm. The problem being that bosses are generally resistant to status effects. Are they? I've never seen that. Um, I once tried to use inhibit on a boss that tried to use the inhibit status effect. <clears throat> Mito, but uh, it didn't do much. Uh, I've never had any problem with flight. I am like poison. A few times I've used it. But so maybe versus the poison boss, and that's for obvious reasons. Like fighting enemies oh, no. on these tightrope scenarios is going to be hell because we cannot risk getting hit at all, and we have to be fucking. <laughs> we have to. We are like relegating ourselves to such shitty damage too. It's just a disaster waiting to happen. I can't see what's going on. Is there something over there? Oh. I broke its legs, don't worry. That's what I'm reminded of every time I use this pipe. It's just like oh, we're shit. breaking the enemy's oh, buttons. I almost dodged off the map. 
Yeah, I try to avoid dodging in these areas. Especially when my mobility is how it is. Looks <coughs> like they're up there too. You'll end up gliding right off the edge. Yeah, I've done that a few times. But I'm pretty good about not falling to my doom anymore. You just gracefully fall to your death. Oh. Look out. And I'm dead. Oh shit. I got fucking launched off the ledge for some reason by that enemy's hit. Don't worry, it's okay. I have a solution. I'll what just run into the missile. Like, I'm just sitting there wondering, how did that enemy launch me off the ledge like that? Let me rest of the missile, let me rest of the missile! <laughs> I can't because of the multiplayer, it's gonna go to signal. Uh, oh, okay. Oof. I just barely. I just barely. Made it. Sound, it sounds like you made it by the skin of your ass cheeks. Yes. Yeah, come over five with me, but I did it. Nice work, Eagle Eye. I've got a signal going out. Yeah. That enemy, though, he was the secret one-punch man of the game. He just went... Just how much damage did he deal to you? None, basically. Oh. But he launched me off the ledge, so I was like, Jesus. Oh, I was wondering why I couldn't revive you. Yeah. Just as ordered, a new ladder. Hmm. Actually, that that makes me think. You know how if they titled the uh, screen is talking about blood codes? Mm-hmm. When you stab the queen with your eighth grade attack, that actually happened. You yep. unintentionally absorbed her blood code. Yep. Which resulted in immediate rejection. Yep. Not so much for sneak attacking that one. Oh, okay, that works too. Well, if you, uh, yeah, if you put venom on your blood bill, you put your, uh, your drain attacks will do venom too. Yeah. What? That enemy dropped down because we were above and it aggroed on us. Now it can't get back to us. <laughs> Ship is stuck on that thorn. Now get ready for that my is... least favorite area in this entire game. That isn't the first thing I've ever been stuck. I've ever seen stuck on a thorn like that. <laughs> Wink. Looks like we're in the enemy's den. I hate this area. It's a passive. There's no areas in this game I thoroughly hate. We get to get spam, fire attack spam throughout us the entire time. I mean, there's these in the shit, I'm gonna get you close to my face. There's just these, uh, gentlemen. Yeah, come on. I, I was trying, and I uh, the next thing I thought to do it's was, I'm a parry it. <laughs> Fuck ladders. <laughs> you regen good? I got four.
stomach bothering you? Alright, sorry about that. Hmm. We should probably... You know what, I was about to say we should probably buff before we go in, but buffing really isn't necessary. I don't buff if there's a cutscene. You know, that, that this boss is intimidating at first. This boss is difficult if you forget about the dumb... Blood Let's things. Actually, that's gonna be the big problem of this fight. How are we gonna deal with the blood pillars? I'm gonna focus hey, on killing the blood pillars whenever they spawn. Alright, he's animated. Wow. We are really doing this with a pipe. Oh, he's dying. He's buffing also. He doesn't have him. 37,000 damage dealt. Excuse me. There we go. Is that a blood spring? Uh, yes, cutscenes. For a moment, it just like made a stand in the boss room, so I was just like, excuse me, what's going on? Mm. I don't like this, this is scary. <laughs> Wait, aren't we going further than you've actually gone? In new NG Plus? Mm. Aren't we going further than where you've gone in NG Plus? Yeah. Huh. That's neat. Um, I don't know exactly where I was. I guess uh, the way it works is if you haven't, if you've been there before in a past one, then it'll be fine. That's... Uh, yeah, we have just passed where I was at NG+. Plus. Neat. Oh no. Hello. Hi. Draconic. What? what? Please be doing a run. Okay. I'm just muting his chat audio so he's not in the stream audio. Um, it's better that you leave this particular one. See ya. Alright. I'm gonna private it. Yeah. Probably should have done that before. Mm -hmm. Sorry about that. It's fine. Alright, so are you through all the cutscenes, or...? Mm, I have to head back to home base for the one thing. Mm. Because of the stupid angel statue. Ah, uh, that's actually where I need that, where I need to go as well, so... We're exactly where I was in my run. Mm.
I'll be right back. I'm being called. Samond. What exactly is going on here? Looks like everyone has gone to rest. Um, you I have to do I can I have a thing. I've got I've got dinner, so I'm gonna dinner break real quick. Mm. Every stream's gotta get have downtime like this. By the way, the last time I I went ahead and subbed your YouTube channel. Oh uh, yeah, I saw. Mm. I got a new skill from all the marks of honor. Cognitive zeal temporarily increases mind and willpower. Hmm. It's pretty decent for gift runs, I suppose. Doesn't seem like you get any more skills for doing this though, just titles and icons. I've got, I've got chicken, zucchini, potatoes, and mushrooms. Mm. Darkseeker has a passive skill called Blood Draining Venom. 
which is revive, mm. receive Iker when enemies within a certain radius take damage from Venom. Ooh. I'm not sure how useful this would be for us, and it's a Dark Seeker locked skill, so it's. Eh. You can easily max proficiency it. No, you can't. It do, you can't max proficiency with it at all. Ah. That's what I mean when it's locked to that class. Well, they had to give the class some use, didn't they? It also doesn't have enough uh, vitality to use cleansing light, which is disgusting. Cleansing light really easy to use. Oh, cleansing light is so good because it's it's healing when you take damage, right? Mm -hmm. For a limited time, a portion of damage you take will slowly heal automatically. So let's say an enemy does about 1k damage, right? You're gonna heal off like 750 of that. That's fucking broken. <coughs> it means you rarely need to heal. Now I think about it, doesn't that negate poison technically? Uh, it makes poison less annoying, yeah, but not completely negate it. It only it also only lasts so long, so and taking that's damage while regenerating is still pretty dangerous for you. That's probably the re that's probably the reason that uh, the moth and the trials uh, depth weren't that wasn't that hard for you. Part of uh, it. I don't think I had it then at that point, mm. and I also didn't really use it for. Most enemies, it's only other for like really tough boss fights. I didn't start using that until very late game. Mm. You know, when Dark Souls, if I was just standing by a bonfire like this, I'd be really paranoid. Because mm. you can be invaded even while you're sitting at one. Huh. It just makes you get up. That's disgusting. The only two safeties are log out of the game or be in Firewind Shrine. What about just playing offline? And that is also technically a safety. But most avid players don't play offline, usually. Mm. Unless they're doing a run. Let's look at the next boss. Elemental damage in general isn't very good. Except for maybe blood. I think blood might be good, so I'm gonna put blood down. <coughs> and let's see. Elemental wall is gonna be nice because it's multiple elements. Since we don't need to gather vestige parts, it's going to save us a lot of time in the dungeon. We just need to find the keys. I guess I'll grab Spoil Spotter. That will save me well, us some time. I probably should have memorized um, where all those vestige parts were in, in the cathedral. Mm. But I didn't. They're just an annoying spot. It doesn't matter, we aren't collecting them anyways. We're not quite collecting them on your run, but uh, yeah. separately, when I'm doing, when I'm doing my, my run, which I'm doing currently, I will be collecting those. Need that true end. Hmm, Assassin increases my drain attack a shitload. Without lowering my other damages at all. And I still get to have my cooling speed. The only problem is it's going to lower my other stats tremendously, and I might not be able to use certain things. What you say, assassin would do would do well for you? 
Yeah, except it doesn't let me use elemental wall and shit because the stats are too low. Mm. It increases your drain attack just a shitload, is the thing, right? Yeah. Well, part of it was something else I had equipped. I'm curious about that thing that I had equipped that was making... Increases damage <coughs> dealt by drain attacks. Tenacious Fang! Mm-hmm. I completely forgot about that. Couldn't you technically, um... With Assassin, cover your ba cover your bases by using the uh, double stat increases? Nah. And we waste too many skill slots. I think I have augmented regeneration and just go back down to 10 regens. And keep improved regen. I get Tenacious Fang, which brings my during attack up to 1084. I should probably actually check how much Tenacious Fang would bump me up. Mm. If, I, if I can upgrade my Black Blood Liberator. Yeah. It's, it's no, never mind. I was looking at a Dark Gift. Where's my drain attack? Thirteen fifth uh, thirteen fifteen with drain tenacious fang. Thirteen fifteen went out. Oh, it increases combo drain. Increases damage dealt by drain attacks performed after a launch attack. Oh. I, don't, I was thinking of sharpened fangs. Increases damage dealt by a special drain performed after a I don't know if I have attack. that. I think sharpened fangs is from, a, is from an item. I think it's from an item found in one of the depths, but I could be wrong. Let's see, storage. Should show up in storage, I think. Sharpens Banks is from Assassin. Oh, well, there you go. I know. Oh, Tenacious Fang is from an item that explains it. Yeah. Dude, that's from parries and back attacks, so it'll be better for you, since I don't really... Don't really do a whole lot of back attacks or parries myself. By the way... Yeah? Assassin also has overdrive. Temporarily increases your and your partner's attack to the back end when you take damage. Oh, I know I have it, but I don't use it because it's bad. Because it'll take damage too often to make it worthwhile, and it doesn't last very long either. <clears throat> so basically, you gotta be good to use it. <laughs> yeah, pretty much. Oh, I almost forgot. I have to actually max the proficiency on it to use it.
since I don't really use that many gifts, uh, weapon attack during rating up isn't really amazing for me. Yeah. So I'm gonna switch that out for sharper tank. Yeah, I either grab bridge to glory or something akin to that. Which code do you get bridge to glory off? Uh, IOs. You get it off That's... of IOs. That's definitely something to have. What about ablative blood? Ablative blood? Uh, Temporary causes damage taken to be greatly reduced at the cost of Iker. I don't really find that worthwhile because I usually am using my Iker for other stuff. <clears throat> I mean, that might- it might be good for me, mainly because I'm the more close combative type. Yeah, well, we both have to get in- get in close is the only thing. Yeah. Oh, no. Well, screw that idea. I would have blood is class locked. Yeah. The strongest ability is always class locked, I've noticed. Mm. Aww. A blood cover received from IO. It holds her firm will to stand up and make personal choices rather than simply being an attendant. You know, on some level, that's that's really nice to read. Because technically, your character plays a part in that. <clears throat> yeah. Oh, if I'm gonna use Bridge to Glory, I need a B plus mind. That that annoys me. That annoys me so also much. Also, getting that my inhibit mind is resistance really... and uh, maxing out its proficiency as soon as you can would be a very ideal idea. Mito. Because there's gonna be a lot of enemies with inhibit later on. The reason Mito comes to mind is because he kicked my ass six ways from Sunday. Yeah, <coughs> he's one of the ones with inhibit. A lot of enemies after him have inhibit too though, so The reason but the the main reason wasn't necessarily the inhibit but on its own on me. It was the fact but on that your he allies didn't too, because then your allies yeah. can use their revival. Are you still eating? Yeah, but I'm almost done. Okay. I'm taking the time while I eat to set to set up and improve myself a bit for the run. Not being able to use Queen Slayer either because it we don't go to the memories too is also pretty oof, but Do you not have Queen Slayer on you? No, we're not using it, remember for this run? Yeah, I know, but specifically because we don't go to the memories for it? Yeah. I have it, but I'm not using it, obviously. My Venerous Claw base is a physical of 1710. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> 
kind of it also, that stuff I might be It also has on. a decently high inhibit resistance. Yeah. Oh, getting inhibit resistance from anything other than a passive might not be the smartest idea. Mm. No, I, I mean like the Veneris already has high invis inhibit resistance. Mm. I mean, if you want status effect resistance from like equipment, the mm -hmm. easiest way to go about that is. Where is it? There's one Blood Veil that just gives insane amounts of. Is it one of the heavy ones? I don't remember. Oh, uh, GXM variant? Oh, here he goes. Black Blood Liberator. It has low defensive stats, but its resistances are insane, except for Inhibit, which is a little bit more normal. Uh, 13 Venom, 12 Stun, 11 Inhibit, 11 Slow, 12 Weak. That's kind of pointless anyways, like I said. I mean, GXM is 109 Venom, 112 Stun, 107 Inhibit, 113 Slow, 124 Weak. Yeah. I mean, in the end, like, they give the same amount of mobility, I and mean, honestly, damage is going to be more important than any means necessary. Yeah, because given the fact that uh, this is a normal run rather than an enhanced run, damage is not going to be the biggest problem at our current stage. Yeah, for now at least, but that's going to change pretty quickly. This next area here that we're going mm -hmm. into is going to be when things get tough, because the enemies don't stagger easily. And they deal lots of damage. This is where backstep spam comes into play. <laughs> yes. This is where <coughs> backstabbing and parrying is going to be the most useful. It's kind of going to be like Metal Gear Rising Revengeance's uh, Revengeance difficulty. Yeah. But like where end up equipping my one blood veil just because I'm more used to parrying with it. It's because the thing is you in Metal Gear Rising Revengeance on the highest difficulty you do boss levels of damage when you parry which is the main your main form of attack. Oh fuck. So basically say I fell off a of ledge. I, I was heading to the <laughs> area so that way I'd be out of the way, but I fucking died. Mm. I fell off a ledge just going towards the statue, oh my god. Hey. At least I'm right there. Okay. Oh they, just, they just stream Sam, like, hits you for half your HP. If you parry him and you uh, go into blade mode, you can one you can basically one-shot his entire HP Kevin bar by barrage so attacking him. Hey, that's there we go, statue activated. Time to go through the path and then call you in. I take it you're just both done eating now? Let's do our best out. Yeah, pretty much. Uh, give me a sec.
where he built the wing. I'm back. We can finally get to the source now, right? <laughs> You can hear me, right? Yeah, I can hear you. Okay. Sorry. Moving out. Gotta love these long winding paths between areas for no reason. Oh. I guess they're trying to but create build up, which is effective if like you're playing the game for the first time but not so effective if you're playing the game again. I've got good and good news and bad news. All right. Uh, good news. Um, you can finish eating Hold in peace without any trouble now. Way. Bad news. Mm -hmm. I have to go. Alrighty. <coughs> have a good day. Yeah. Uh, we can continue this next time. All right. Mhm. Mm